today it's a beautiful day in the Khan and now we are doing the test of the brand new Wally. Maximum speed what you can get 35 Maximum speed by the factory declaration it's 38 miles per hour but we were getting something around uh, 35 and I think that was uh, normal because the group of journalists were on the boat and the general condition of the sea was uh, not like ideal like on a boat test by the factory The challenge which is put in a concept of the new Wally Tender 48 was in the brand new hull which is powered by the IPS system and to keep a still original DNA Wally style. After the short test in front of the Khan, we are coming back to the harbor to speak with two persons who are the most competent to talk about a new Wally. Yes, this is the new Wally tender, 48 feet. It's an evolution of our iconic uh, tender who was launched uh, in uh, 2002. So after 17 years, uh, we thought that there was a time to do to develop that concept that was so successful. Actually, uh, the Wally tender opened the market for let's say these big tenders. Uh, this tender is slightly bigger because the original was 45 feet, and uh, it's much more comfortable. We have the Sea Keeper on board. Uh, we have a good cabin, a nice uh, bathroom with separate shower, and we have air conditioning in the cabin. So, and also we can have a galley outside uh, that can be personalized by the taste of the owner. Are you targeting the same market? Uh or is it now the market change for, for this kind of people? I think we are targeting... No, the market is the same, I would say, but it's much bigger. At the beginning, we were actually targeting clients and that market was not yet there. So we really uh, formed uh, the market no? by zero, by, by scratch. And they, step by step, they understood that on any size of boat, it was much, much uh, better to have a big tender following the just a small tender that you could uh, have on board. Because the, the yachts can stay at the anchor in the bay and you can move move from the yacht to the harbor with a big tender uh, for whatever, I mean, uh, shopping of the family or the guests or the shopping of the crew. So uh, it's, a, it's a kind of uh, new feature that today uh, all the yachts, uh, let's say beyond 24 meters, uh, have understood that they really need. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm Stefano De Vivo to start. I'm the Chief Commercial Officer of Ferretti Group and the Managing Director for Wally. Uh, as you know, we acquired Wally uh, just a few months ago, but already the first new baby of a collaboration has been born. Uh, she is a fantastic yacht, fantastic tender. Of course, if, uh, at 48 feet, it's a little bit uh, reducive to call it tender. Uh, it's got all of the newest features, great attention to detail and fantastic upgrades that the old 40, Tender 45 didn't have. So we concentrated on all those things that all of our users were saying, oh, if I could have a new one, I would put this, I would put that. So opening wings to increase uh, the area where you can lie down. Uh, fantastic passerelle that acts also as uh, a swim ladder, really easy to come in and out and then the typical fender, but this time it's all one piece so that it gives better line, better look and better protection when you're getting close to a boat. Thank you. Thank you very much. And let's go try it. Yes. It is uh, an evolution of uh, the Wally classic hull of a Wally tender. It's a brand new hull. It's uh, bigger, it's longer, it's definitely wider. Uh, and it's been optimized for IPS use. 
Um, Wally had already made uh, IPS uh, boats for larger boats, but for a smaller one they hadn't. So this is where, together with Ferretti Group, we developed a, a hull shape that could work for the IPS. And I think you'll appreciate when we go out that it's uh, been optimized and it hasn't lost its Wally uh, DNA of going straight into the waves, cutting them without banging everywhere and keeping up high, uh, high speed uh, in, uh, in, in bigger waves. What's the specific reason for IPS? Well, the reason for IPS is that. And ease of usage. This is a boat that we think for our crews, because we'll have a lot of them that are going to owners that have other bigger yachts. But it's also thought for those owners that don't want to have a crew and therefore having a joystick and having the dynamic positioning means that you can really go around in complete safety on your own any weather condition but in the Wally DNA and as they developed it in the last few years on the Wally 45 the Wally 45 X uh, we're gonna have an outboard uh, version so an X version also for the Wally 48 tender so in Miami, February 2020, you will see an outboard version. And the great, the great thing is that it's going to be a 50 plus knot boat. You're going to have again the joystick feature because you need to have it to make sure that we still have this ease of use. And the other beautiful thing is that, did you see the passerelle that can act as a swim ladder? and uh, as, uh, as a passerelle to disembark the, the engines will be placed in couples uh, a bit on the sides so that you can still keep that feature which is a fantastic feature that boats this size don't have um, it just makes it so much easier and so much more fun to go in and out of the water and at that point that's where you're gonna find out that also the two, the two wings are even more useful once you have the outboards that take up a little bit of your swim platform we normally don't declare just south of 900,000 and you say the price point for this boat will be lower than uh, previous wallies pure wally wallies I mean is, is that just because you're greater buying power or is it uh, just for greater buying power and the efficiency and the fact that we can produce more and therefore your investment is amortized uh, on, uh, on more units and therefore it costs less to the client. So you're not... So the richness of a boat is actually, you can ask Mr. Bassani, that was his biggest, uh, you know, not, 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 not scare, but clearly th the biggest question mark. And I, I think that uh, after we finished uh, the first boat, he was uh, more, than, uh, more than happy with what came out. And you can see it from the staircase and the, and the, and the flooring inside. As he's always done, we didn't <laughs> we didn't cut short on on, on cost. And so, sort of build quality, everything that goes on behind the scenes, the technology behind it is as good, if not better, than it's ever been. Absolutely, okay. it can use the power of a company that has eight brands, that has a huge R and D and technical department, and can be coupled together with. Uh, what was inside the know-how of the people in, in what? What better than that? Luca, who's our typical buyer here? The typical who, buyer? Who are we aiming this boat at? I mean, we had very different buyers because we had a lot of buyers that have been using as a real tender for big yachts but not not just big yachts even medium size even 24 meter uh, sail yacht because uh, uh, th this boat as a tender is giving to them the possibility to stay in the bay and just move the tender and not going back in the harbor with, with the big boat uh, but we also had a lot of owners that are just using this as a day uh, a day sailor, no? uh, I mean, because they have the villa, uh, like in Saint Tropez in Sardinia, or they usually go to a, a nice hotel uh, at the seaside and then they want the boat uh, to spend the day in the water. So, I mean, very different. I mean, 
But it's a Category B, right? So it's designed to go quite far offshore. Absolutely. I mean, you, you can start from here and go to Palma de Mallorca. This was a very rare and beautiful opportunity where we had the chance to talk with Luca Bessani, maker of the whole Wally brand, and Stefano De Viva, who is responsible for the new growth of Ferretti Group. And now you can see my colleague journalist trying to get the all possible information about RPM of the engine's sound fuel consumption. For me, I prefer to sit behind the wheel. I prefer to feel and to catch the essence of the boat, DNA of Wally Tender 48.